very well for himself and decided he was going to give back. So he is donating $1,000 organic chemistry scholarship. So now I'm going to. I should listen to my wife and get a <laughs> <laughs> um, I do want to thank um, the, the dean and the faculty for allowing me to present um, to the, the town students. I know we're very proud to see all the great work the professors have done ever since I've been a student. Now we have more and more talented. And thank you. Now, Professor Nina Stein from Chemistry. So I have to say, many years ago, Nam was like one of you out here receiving, with his mother, who's here tonight too, um, receiving awards and scholarships. So um, I wanted to say something about the scholarship because this is only the second time representing it. So. Um, this is being this was created by Anthony, who we know as Nam Wang, in memory of his older brother, who is also a student here, um, Wendell, who we knew as Wen Wang. Um, both of them were my organic chemistry classes when they were here. Um, so I want to say a little bit about Wendell. That's his older brother, the one who the scholarship is commemorating. He was a pre-pharmacy student when he was at this campus. And he got accepted by the pharmacy program. He was actually here in uh, 1987 to 88. He went up to stores. He graduated in 1992, became a pharmacist. And then eight years after he graduated, um, he was actually thinking of getting married at the time, was planning to change his career, thinking of switching to go to medical school. And that was when he got diagnosed with cancer. And this was one of those tragic situations where the diagnosis came after it had already spread. So he had, they tried several different types of remedies and nothing worked and he should come 13 months after the diagnosis. So um, two years, I guess it was two and a half years ago, I got a call from Nam, who I hadn't heard from him all these years, but I remember him, um, saying that he wanted to create the scholarship in memory of his brother, and also in recognition of the chemistry courses he took here. So we're very proud and pleased about that. And so we decided um, to give the, the award to a student who's currently in the organic chemistry class, but who's taken general chemistry courses here and who's excelled in chemistry. And Dr. Kobe and I together um, nominate the winner. And the winner this year is Shanan Nunia Wailoi. I want to say a few things. First of all, the interesting thing is there are a lot of qualities about Shana, and I told both of them this, that remind me a lot of Nam when he was here. Um, like Nam, he's a um, very earnest, sincere individual, very studious, and um, not to mention a very good student with a lot of intellectual curiosity. Um, I actually, over the course of the academic year, I have seen Shannon mature both personally and academically. He started out being very quiet, more or less on the sidelines of the class, and he's now developed into a leader in, in that organic chemistry class. And also academically, he's gotten to the point now, his understanding of the principles are so good that lots of times he's able to answer his own questions. He's able to catch my mistakes. <laughs> and he's able to use his thinking to make predictions going beyond what we normally expect from a student at this level. But I want to say something else about him. Is whenever I give a quiz or an exam in my organic chemistry course, and I go back to my office, and then there's a student at the door, is greater than the 99% probability that it's going to be Shannon. And um, he comes to to discuss some of the principles to make that we're on the exam, you know, to make sure his understanding is correct. Occasionally, 
Um, he recognized his effort, like let's just do effort, he said that he made mistakes and wants to come and confirm that his understanding now is correct. And I have to say that and his mistakes are not really big mistakes. And at first, I'm always really worried, and I assured him that if that's the only mistake he made, you're going to get a really good grade. And then I soon discovered, and he actually told me this, but I discovered it myself, that that wasn't the point. It wasn't the grade. It was the understanding that was really important to him. Um, and there's one more thing I wanted to say. Uh, oh, yeah. He's very thorough in his understanding and attempts not only to understand the general principles, but all the details as well. So, Shannon is a PNB major. That's that told me this physiology and neurobiology, I think. Um, he wants to go to medical school, and I think his qualities, especially his attention to detail, will serve him very well. I think that he will make a very fine physician and a researcher, whatever he decides, whatever path he decides to follow. So, I am very pleased to present the Wendell M. Wong Chemistry Award. So this was 